Hey guys, I'm Holly Elegy and welcome to episode 3 of Better Minecraft. I just wanted to start this episode by thanking everyone who subscribed to the channel. We've already passed 100 subscribers and it's so exciting. Thank you all so so much. In this episode, we're going to do a lot of mining today. We're hopefully going to get a good amount of iron and maybe some diamonds. But I'm aiming for iron tools and armour and maybe if we have time maybe we'll do a small farm but we do have quite a bit of food at the moment so grab a drink get comfy and let's get going let me just get rid of all of the stuff i don't need and then we need food we'll take half of our bread as well all right i think we're just gonna start just here we'll, we'll empty out a little bit just so we can get here a little bit easier so we want to be able to get to and from our mine very easily. Um, I think I'm just going to do this. So there's a little, it's a walkway. Perfect. Oh, we want a door, don't we? Let's let me go back and get a door. And then just to make sure the stuff doesn't kind of creep up on us when we're in the mine. Um, where would our door be? Up in the wood. There we go. We'll put that in our offhand. There we go. Look at us already. Hopefully this isn't our first bit of iron and then we don't get any from now on. <laughs> I really hope not. I really want to get at least full iron armor, which we already have. The helmet and leggings. Um, so we only need a chest plate and boots, and then I want some full, like, iron tools. And then I think just maybe a little bit extra, like I'd like a bucket. Um, and then just some, just some leftover iron in case anything breaks. Okay. So there is some lapis there. Mm. But we should go get the other door, just so we can do some underwater mining. Anything up here? Yes, iron. Nice. I'm glad I checked this little corridor. Ah, uh, any more? No, just the one. That's okay. And there is some copper over there. We're going to make sure we get copper. Because it's not really a very functional block. Oh, is it? Wait, hang on. Is there more copper stuff? Oh, wow. Look at all those new blocks. Okay. I need all of the chipped tables. A copper lantern. Oh, we have to try this. Fish oil? A <laughs> blobfish. That's amazing. I didn't realise there were so many blocks in here. Copper golem spawn egg. Ooh. <gasps> Vertical slabs. Nice. Copper barrel. Ooh. There's so many, many things I need to look at. I haven't even, like, delved into yet. Right, I'll go back to this main area. I think we came from... Okay, we came from right here. Oh, maybe just here. And then we know that this is where we came from. Right, so what's over here? Oh, iron. This is a bit too far away. I'm just going to move over one. There we go. Oh, any more than one? No. There we go. We can keep going now. So we'll just cover this up. Ah. There we go. It's literally episode three, guys, and I've only just noticed whenever I pick something up, it says the amount that you're picking up at the bottom, of the bottom right of the screen. Oh, that was really cool. 
So when my stone pickaxe broke, it automatically switched it out for my other stone pickaxe. That is so cool. I don't have to like, you know, I'm like, I just don't have to go through my entire inventory. Like if I had a really, really full inventory and if I had backpacks and everything, I wouldn't have to go through all of it just to find the other pickaxe. That's amazing. I loved the ideas we got from last episode's comments. So there was ideas of carrying the camp idea on, but kind of adding some more like realistic kind of, I guess decor or just realistic aspects to it a little bit more. I just, I really like that idea because I mean, it would just, it'd make the area a little bit better looking. The other idea was just making like a, a small medieval castle, but kind of keeping the pink theme. And I love both of these ideas. They're really, really nice ideas. If anyone else has any other ideas as well, I'd love to kind of, you guys give me the ideas. I'll take them on board and see what I can do. But at the moment, seeing as we're still kind of starting out, it's only episode three. We've only spent about 12 to 13 in-game days at the moment. So I don't think I'm going to take on a big project yet. But I would love these ideas and I really, really welcome you guys to give me any more ideas and I'll take them on and I'll see what I can do with those. But at the moment, I think we're going to stick with the camp idea and we're just going to see kind of what we can do. We're going to make some farms. If we don't get started with that this episode, then I think that's what we'll do next episode. And then we can decorate a little bit more and maybe just maybe even get started with farm animals and just kind of establish ourselves a little bit more because at the moment we've just got our little starter tent which is really cute and i really really like it but we're gonna get this geode i uh, see so make sure okay this isn't okay right we won't be able to get all of this amethyst geode just because our pickaxe is kind of dying right now and we still kind of, I might just go through this geode to be honest with you, just because we need really some diamonds. I would like to get loads of iron, but we've only found it's 11 pieces and we've used some of it on our pickaxe already. So we really need to stop being more careful, I guess, but I will use it just for this deep slate because it takes so long to break. Oh, this just reminded me. I wanted to, to search this up. What was it? R-H-Y. Okay, so it's only used as kind of a building block. <laughs> hey, more iron. Please be more than one. No, please. I'm just going to grab this iron. place you down and that's the most awkward place to put it but it's okay and I'm going to make a hole in the floor <laughs> where we can put all the blocks we don't want we might need pebbles later on but for now I'm not going to pick up all the pebbles and you done you are nice and we'll put some torches Oh, we're a nightmare. We keep forgetting to put torches up here. All right, guys, I have Googled it and I'm being a bit silly. So from the update 1.20, it's been the iron ore generates, um, the iron ore generates 90 times per chunk. So I believe it's a 16 by 16 is so 90 per 16 by 16 chunk between levels 80 and 380. Between the levels we were looking at, it's only 10 times. So per chunk, there's only 10 iron ore, I believe. Um, so we're going to find some sort of hill or mountain and mine some iron that way because there's no point really looking for iron where we're really not going to find it. So... I think we definitely, definitely need an iron pickaxe. I just want to make sure that we're able to break things that we need to. So we're going to make sure we have an iron pickaxe on us. And we have a chest plate already. I know it's not great, it being leather, 
But I think we need some little booties. And then we have some six left over. I don't... Mm, would I need a shield? Is there any other shields? Like a wooden shield or something? So at the moment I think we'll just go with the wooden shield. Okay, so I don't think it works like that. But due to that, we can't actually have torches in our offhand, which is a bit of a pain. But in the end, it'll be fine. I believe we're all set. Say goodbye to our lovely little house. And we're just going we need to find some sort of hill or mountain. There's another, um, what do you call it? You know, like a castle, like over here by the village, there's kind of a castle ruin. That's what I called it. It could just be a stone village kind of ruin. But I, th I think thinking of it of a castle is so much better. But I think we can go down here. Because that will give us loads of loot. Uh, is this way? Yes, it's this way. It's just at the other side of this forest, but we need to find some sort of hill. It's got to be Y level 80 at least. We want it to go as high as possible. And then we can get lots of iron. Hello, piggy. We're just going to go this way. We're going to raid this area. Maybe it will open this area as well. That looks like a ravine. We might be able to get some stuff from that as well. So there is a bit more exploring than I wanted to do prior to this episode, but I'm not complaining. I would just really love to get some iron. <gasps> I need that tree. I need the spruce. Give me the spruce. Spruce is the best tree. Please tell me it's spruce. No, it's a fur log. Oh, then we can go back to finding that those ruins. <gasps> Seal! I need a bow and arrow. Come on, I dare you. Ha! Ah. How dare you nick my food. I think it was food. I don't know, he dropped a tea leaf in my face. <laughs> But uh, I don't know what he took. Beetroot, Tegumis. Okay, I don't want any of these. Um, oh, maybe, maybe that. I'll keep that on me. Oh, hello. You look so cute. Yes, you're nodding at me. I'm going to name you Steve. You look like a Steve. I'm just going to take all the plants here. There we go, cabbage seeds. And there's more here. Ooh, that looks very cool. The copper here. I know that's like a, is it a fish? <laughs> I could like a lobster a little, a little bit. I know it's supposed to be a person, but <laughs> it kind of reminds me of a, like a lobster or something. Are these all fir trees? I think they are. Yeah, they are. Oh, could you just mix in one? It's just one spruce tree. Okay, so the, we are kind of going up, I believe, up there. That would be great for mining, so we'll go up there after. But I would like to loot this place first. We'll go the furthest down here. And remember when you're in if you're playing better minecraft make sure you get all everything that's kind of fallen into the house because that is a whale wow i don't know if i'm excited or scared <laughs> whales are huge if 
I saw a whale in real life, I would like if I was in the sea and I saw a whale, I would like if I was not on a cruise cruise ship, because that you know they're a bit too big for a whale to eat. <laughs> I would just think my life's gonna end. Ah, <gasps> stone. Uh, I'm gonna break you with an iron pickaxe. And thank you to the same commenter who said about the blue skies mod. I I didn't know that you could replace waystones. I'm just gonna get rid of it and put it somewhere out more open. Uh, maybe just over here. Maybe up here. Um, beach ruins. Yeah, I had no idea that you could like. I was a bit iffy about picking the waste waystones up in case I broke it and. You know, it never came back again. <laughs> so thank you to that commenter. Another one. Oh, this one's broken. That's sad. But do you have like gold or something in here? No, you don't. Okay. I'm sorry for ah, filing your statue. That, that scared me. Emeralds, nice. Where's my boat gone? Did I leave it? Ah. Well, okay. Um, let's make a, another shovel. An orca. Is that it? Ah! Oh my god, I literally jumped. <laughs> oh, don't scare me like that. Oh, I'm never going in the water ever again. Oh, should we take the waystone back to our house? Maybe we'll have to craft one. Ooh, that's that's a shout. I might do that instead. Because I do like this area, but it's not too far away from home. I think it'd be better if we actually keep it, and then... We could just get home easier whenever we find like a wild waystone. Okay, so we should go back to the campsite. See, I, I'm keeping. I'm gonna keep getting distracted. We need to go up here. Okay, let's make a way, a waypoint here. Right, we've made a need to go waypoint here because we we need to go up here. This looks really really cool. Blue leaves, Mystic Grove. It's called, and then it's purple water and everything. But right now, for this episode, we need to go up to like a hill or a mountain. We need to get some iron. That is the goal for this episode. I'm going to try not to forget it. Because <laughs> I, I get distracted very easily. Another little structure here. I think it'd be really, really cool if we could just build up these little like ruined areas. Like this could be like a guard lookout area. We're gonna go this way. Yes, we're gonna go this way to this little house down here. Um, then we're gonna go home. All right. Um, I need my boat out for this one. I'm hoping to find another waypoint so I can keep the one in my inventory. Alright, let's get these flowers. Mm. 
Oh, there's this house. I'm hoping there's no bad guys in it. It might be the person from Blue Skies again. Ah. No more death for me. Um, let's get me some sleep. Hello, where are you? You're over here. Blue journal. Thank you. Oh, I can get both of these. A zeal lighter. Oh, okay, well... I'll have to Google what this is for, but thank you. Uh, blue journal, an adventurer's guide, an adventurer's guide, the gatekeeper. This item only ne needs to be used once. I guess I won't use it yet. <laughs> um, oh, there's potatoes. Was that onions? They're onions. Get rid of the sticks. Oh, there's also flowers here. Oh, okay. They're just been retextured. Cool. They're nice though. I get rid of. I'll get rid of the one arrow. I don't need the one arrow. I can nick. And oh, oh, I had paper. What did I get rid of it? I'm gonna get rid of the furnace. Then I'll take you. Anything else I can go to before we go home? Oh, there's a temple there. Go there, and then we can head home. Oh, hello. Ooh. So scary. Yeah, I'm not staying here. <laughs> These are cave spiders. No, thank you. Especially with no torches. I've only got lanterns with me. I think we can go back now. Anything else? Nope. Redwood Forest. Oh, we're just kind of going back to um the area where that village was. Oh, we can just go back home then. I think we just go... Oh, literally in the direction I'm looking at. Amazing. I might get these. Can I pick up more flowers? There is more iron there, I'm just gonna grab that. Oh, one piece, really? I don't wanna have to swim and um, mine more, so I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna go this way. This way. Why do I keep looking at the map when it's literally. There's, they're all on my screen. Oh, we'll go back to that at some point. <laughs> At the moment, it's just, I don't really want to deal with cave spiders. That's why I didn't, kind of, I didn't explore into those. Oh, that's why I didn't go into those two mines that we saw. Because I'm pretty sure that it's just going to be field cave spiders. So I didn't want to have to go through that. <laughs> um... When we get more equipped, maybe when we have diamond, I'll, I'll go do that. Yay, got the flowering saplings. Right, I'm going to go around the bear. I don't think it'll attack me, but I'm way too jumpy today. I'm going to be down here. Oh, I'm too jumpy. We'll just row through this lovely, lovely river. I love the reflections as well on the water. That's really, really cool. I swear, if a, if if a whale pops up right now, I'm gonna jump out my seat. <laughs> 
I'm gonna go on land. I feel safe on land. I don't feel safe on the water. Okay. I can't see any um any whales right now. All for the better. Ooh, I think we've already looked at this guy, but Yes. Oh no we haven't. Oh, I was about to be really silly. Thank you for the iron. Alright, let's sort all of our stuff out. Oh, I need to cook you straight away. Um, food and planting. Food down here. Um, planting up here. Well, I guess plants will go in here, actually. Rather than... Oh, I'll keep, keep those in there. Miscellaneous. Right, so I want to make a these ones the chipped. So uh, carpenter's table. So three wood planks axe. Iron crafting table. Perfect. Carpenter's table. We need a loom. Crafting table, wool, and a stick. Wool. I don't think we have any wool. I've come across a lot of wool, but I haven't picked any of it up. Um, We don't have wool. Okay, so I'm going to take two of you. I'm going to go get some sheep. Um, Mason table. Brick, clay, and a crafting table. Put three of those here. Um, go. What else do we need? Tinkering table. TNT. Okay, we're gonna get that for a while. Mason table. We just need one of those. Um, mason table, go. We'll put all these here. Loom. Okay, I just need wool. And then we've got the other one. Here one is. You. Bad, you do. The loom. Thing. So we need to make a little area for all of these tables and then we need to make some sort of platform or just something for the waste stone. Amazing. And then we will take some of this. What can we make out of gravel? can make some different types of gravel. Gravel, ooh, gravel brick. And twigs. Okay, so nice. I like that. And we'll do some of that. So we've got two types of those. Ooh, cobblestone bricks, nice some of those as well. What about andesite? Oh, an andesite chimney. I like that a lot. We want different types. Andesite gravel. A botanist workbench. That wasn't up there, was it? Oh, we can make this. That's easy. Flower pots. Slabs, sticks. 
that. Eat the free stick. Um, three flower pots. Two slabs, yes, okay. I need a word. Perfecto. Amazing, so we just need two more. So we'll sleep in the meantime. We're actually gonna see, is it at chipped? Like this is the at is so botanist glass blower up and okay so we've got alchemy okay so the big things we need is a brewing stand and enchanting table tinkering we can't do glass blower or oh, blast furnace oh that catch be oh do you want to use all the iron Maybe five, but you know what we we could do. It. I think we should do it. using. We'll put all of them here. I'd like to get as many as we can. The glass flower we just have next. Um, so we need brick. Okay, so we need to cook more of these. I think is that is it not? I think it's four actually. Perfect. Um, so glass blower, glass furnace, I just need a normal furnace now. No? Am I doing it wrong? Oh, I need smooth, okay. Smooth stone. Bum, bum. Brick. So I need a crafting table. So logs and a piece of glass. So I need sand. Bum, bum, bum. Amazing. And then we just need the logs. And the, oh, we need one bit of iron. Amazing. Perfect. So we have five different types at the moment. We aren't able to get the alchemy bench or the tinkering table. But after that we have all of them, which is amazing. And then we need to make a little platform. I might just make to this. Um I'm gonna hang on, let me just do that. I'm gonna take all of this out of here, put them all in my inventory. And where, I think we should make it opposite of our little house. What do we think? We could, I, we want the farm there. I feel like maybe facing us might look really, really nice. We could put a bridge here at some point. Just like a bridge between here and maybe do two wide. Just do it here. That'd look really nice. We'll keep those two there just for... Kind of, um, I guess like a little reminder we want a bridge here. And I think just here will be fine. And then we will kind of mess it up a little bit. Oh, 
I want it to kind of look not old, but kind of old. <laughs> like it's it's an old waste stone. It's been here for a while. Yeah, maybe this. Hello, little guy. Maybe if we kind of change the floor a little bit as well. just like this so we can always make it kind of go directly where the bridge will be so up a little bit we'll get rid of this one and place a dirt block back Maybe the yeah, same here. Which is this? Mm, I think we'll get rid of this one. There we go. I think that's nice. Kind of blends in. Maybe put one here. Really? Thank you. It just kind of blends in with the area a little bit more. Nice. So we've got our waste stone now. Maybe shall I put it back a little back one? Yeah. I think that looks better. It's more like walking room up front. Nice. So you first let's go unnamed and then we can actually rename it to uh, the outpost. I like that. <laughs> and then go home and we first see our little house and there'll soon be a farm there. And obviously a bridge as well. But for now I think I might just make another little uh, a little tent um, just to put all of our workstations in. The other idea is maybe like some sort of I'd say not really a gazebo, but like a sheltered area that's just for like crafting and stuff. Not really sure. Let me put all of this away. I think maybe for now the tent idea because I can always change my mind later and then just decide that I want to kind of I just want to change it up and I want to put a gazebo or whatever my idea is later I'm thinking maybe the trumpets it's not such a different kind of color it's definitely more red it's not as red but let's get one of each of these types of wood out. And let's have a play around of which we want to use. Yep, we've got to make sure it'll go with the pink. What would we like to do? I don't want to go either of these two because they're too close to the jungle. Um, I'm thinking maybe the the trumpet let's try the trumpet if not we can always just replace it with the ja jacaranda we can always replace it with the jacaranda wood later so first of all to start this off we need this we just need these make it a little bit bigger so this is three in the middle we want to make it probably five 
Where do we want it? Let's go over here and then we can plan out where we want our workshop tent. Our little home is here. I feel like maybe just after where we've cleared. And the workshop can be just next to the clearing, which will be our farm. are we thinking let me just empty this area quick we need a light in here let me go get a lantern let's do two that's quite a big area okay there's a, there's a, there is a hole there <laughs> we need a little there and we need a fence perfect right there amazing and then we will put that side there we go got stuck a thing right so this is this side it's quite thin, but it's quite wide in the middle. And then we've got the front. The side and the back. I don't like that you can't see through, but if we really wanted, we could just do that. <laughs> we could always change it later because now we've got a 
carpenter's table, haven't we? Have an unodd hammer. Oh, that can be good. Hang on a minute. Maybe. Oh. See, some of them you place on the left, some of them you place on the right. I think I'll just kind of extend it this way a little bit because we've got space this side. And I didn't realise just how much space this would take. So maybe I might extend it just up to there. I'm gonna put a little path just here. That'll be where the farm is after this. We put a tall lavender there. It's just like a, a big square here <laughs> just for our maybe bit there nice and we'll put some of these flowers around as well I 
just need some grass now. Guys, I think I'm going to end the episode here. If you look behind us, we've done absolutely loads this episode. We've got an amazing warpstone area. Oh, sorry. Waystone area just behind us. And then we're going to have a bridge just over this lake. Maybe next episode. We don't know yet. And then next to our house, we've just got a path all the way to the workstation tent which is the lovely trumpet log to just give a pop of a different colour but it's still kind of it's a warm tone so it still goes with the pink tint and then we've just added some more different flowers and pops of colours that you can see a bit more I'd zoom in over here a bit more of the bright pinks lighter colours along with all of the purple lavender that we have here but thank you guys I've loved this episode and thank you again for over 100 subscribers. I'm over the moon. Thank you guys so, so much. And I will see you in episode four. Bye.